Hi guys, it's Mike Hansen from Hansen Fitness for Golf and I'm at the PGA's Tour Superstore in Irvine, California. And just an awesome store with, with plenty of products and, and every golf thing you can think of. It's a golf playground for anybody to play golf. And we're do, doing our pain series here and we're, I'm gonna talk to you today about shoulder pain and how it's caused from your golf swing and what you can do with one simple exercise and one simple stretch that'll help either alleviate that or even eliminate that pain that's caused by your golf swing in your shoulder. The golf swing causes the shoulder to go through a lot of range of motion. And a lot of times we'll see forward bend. I know we talk about this a lot, but it's so important is forward posture in the shoulder. And what that does is it takes the shoulder out of alignment and it causes it to go through a range of motion it's not used to going through or it doesn't want to go through. So it's forced to go through different ranges of motion in the golf swing. So one thing that we want to do is try and get that shoulder blade or shoulders back. And there's two exercises that are great for that. And one is the T, so you wanna bend forward in your golf posture and just squeeze your shoulder blades just like this and it's a short movement, about 15 of those. And then you go into a Y, just like that. Try and make sure that you maintain your posture. So you wanna make sure that you stay down in your posture and you're just going about 10 inches of movement. That's all you wanna do and squeeze the back. Three sets of 15 and you're really gonna feel a good burn in that upper back and that's gonna help get your shoulders in a better position and allow them to move a little bit more freely and try and eliminate some of that shoulder pain that you have. In the golf swing, the shoulder has to go through what's called external rotation a lot, even if you're right-handed or left-handed because both arms are going through external rotation. If you're a right-handed golfer on your backswing, your right shoulder is going through external rotation and that's where the arm goes out. On your downswing, when you follow through, your left arm is going through external rotation. So we want to make sure that we're pretty flexible in that area. So this is a great stretch. You can use anything. I'm using a tubing here. All you're going to do is tuck your elbow in tight and let your arm come back as far as your shoulder will allow. Just to feel a little bit of stretch and hold it there. One thing you want to make sure is that your shoulder is back as far as it can go when you do that stretch. And to get the, once you get to the stretch, you can just turn your shoulders just a little bit and allow that to stretch. You can use a door frame or anything for this. And you want to just hold that for about 15 to 30 seconds. And you should feel a good stretch in the back there. And then also other side. So you're just going to hold it and allow that to stretch. Keep your arm in tight and your shoulder back. Do that for about 30 seconds, two times on each side, along with the T's and Y's. And that will give you much better shoulder mobility and stability. And hopefully eliminate some of that shoulder pain that you have from your golf swing.